Yeah, if, if all else fails, feel free to pause or something briefly. Yep. Until we uh, finish going on about whatever. So I just hit record, so we're, we're good. So I'm here with, once again, V. And hey, hey. Mix. Hey. And we're watching, what is this? Uh, this is going to be Takeshi versus Gar. And you're playing against Anne. I think Anne dropped for the tournament, but... Uh, yes, that's right. You... Uh, I wanted to get a game with you because Takeshi. Mm -hmm. uh, and similarly, I think this is one of the few games with Gar in it. Yeah. So it's so, funny. I'm I'm gonna let this play a little bit, and then I'll, I'll pause it once pairs are down and all that. Uh, but I played against Gar uh, to practice for this tournament, just see, hey, is Gar a character I want to play? And I played against her with Dolores, and I'm like this. This Gar character's terrible. Because, uh, you know, I played against her with the Dolores. Uh, and then I played against Anne's Gar in the tournament and 100% got wrecked. So. Yeah, Dolores does the zoning. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Gar does not like the zoning, so you don't, you don't, you don't like that matchup. And so, I thought that, like, Gar's only thing was, like, eruption was, like, the only thing you really had to worry about, but that ended up not no, being No, that's true. very much not the case. Um, so both of these characters are oppressor archetypes in the sense that they tried to be stat sticks, and it's the opponent's job to counter them. And the problem is that Gar actually has to, like, they both have the same plan A, throw out their good attacks and win and yep. like hoping their opponent is uh, just going to fall to it. And the problem is that that actually works for Gar. So Takeshi has to go to plan B. All right, so uh, here This we is go. already not what I remember uh, playing in this game. So, um, so here if we you're go. expecting me to remember what the heck I was oh, doing, no. etc. Well, but, I hope that you'll remember some, but mostly it'll be just, uh, I hope that uh, you can give us some insight on Gar. What do we got here? So switch. Sure. So this is the spinner. And I am basically daring Gar to advance, because that's what a lot of her cards do. If she doesn't advance, her options are limited. Um, the thing about Gar is that she can play Blazing Sun at any time and knock away my weapon. Yeah. So that means that I can't go with my, again, plan A, which is Chili Dispenser. Yeah. Um, so, basically, um, knowing me, this is probably a dodge expecting her to advance getting a free chip. The other option is probably going to be something like Heavy Burst. Okay, and she is on... Give me one second here. Switch. Um, what is that? Those options are so unsafe. They both lose to advance. Switch uh, unless you want to stick with Mage 1. Let's see. Yeah, so as long as I can stay away from um, range 1, that's good for me. In addition, um, in order to get to range one, she has to activate spinner. So it's a question of how much she respects that. What does that look like to you? Is that uh, in Gar's discard too? Is that freezing blizzard hurl? Uh, that's probably correct. Right. I think it's blue green. Yeah, it is. Sick. See that? Look at that eyesight points. Uh, uh. All right, here we go. So yeah, I I do want to actually before I, I hit uh play V. I, I wanted to talk about when I played you uh, with Zen, I think it was Zen, uh, against your Takeshi. Mm -hmm. um, I, sure. I think. Uh, I don't remember. It might have been somebody I, else. I remember I played two games against your um, Zen, yeah. and I remember so then, that one of them was Moko. Correct. So yeah, when I played against your Takeshi with Zen, you started yes with Chili Dispenser, and I remember just getting stat sticked out. Right, like yep. uh, I could not overcome raw stats, you know, uh, stun guard, etc. And just the hit effect on Chili Dispenser ended up being uh, super, super relevant. Especially against Zanisha, yes. Yes. But okay, so you're starting here with the spinner. What does this thing even do? Uh, Huge okay. range, a uh, little bit of prior uh, debuff, and anytime she advances, she pays for it in chip. Yep. And so, all of her stuff has some advance on it, right? Uh, not all of it. Um, Freezing Blizzard, I believe, has a retreat if she wants it. 
Uh, Grasping Darkness, I believe, also has a retreat if she wants it. Um, the only okay, one of those yeah. that's relevant here is going to be Grasping Darkness, think? which is end of beat. So um, she's either advancing or she's staying put for the relevant portion of this beat. And then what are you expecting from Gar here? Is it just like Blazing Sun Step? Are we trying that or... You know, Blazing Sun Step is an option. Uh, really, anything that she does that's Blazing Sun is... I want it out of her hand. So right. if she plays Blazing Sun, no matter what it is, it's good. I would expect, if that happens, to be something like Blazing Sun Lunge. Because that hits full board. And you have to choose your weapon uh, and reveal weapon at the same time as discards, right? Um, it's actually before, but we only learned about that during the semifinal. Got so it. I so I selected my weapon last. Got uh, it. Either yeah, way, I, if um, I had I seen the I spinner, think... I think I might have kept switch as guard. To be honest, like um, I know that sounds a bit crazy, but like if I saw uh, if why? I saw the spinner, well, because if I don't, you know, it gives me the option for a not advance, right? I see your logic, but but like. The thing about Gar is using. Oh, yeah. Never mind, all of her stuff has zero. Uh, for more stuff, right? <laughs> Switch yeah. is a really bad style for Gar when she has a lot of styles that do what. Ignore uh, what all of what I they just said. They all have her, like zero fire. Right? Literally, all her that, styles are right. Switch. Right. <laughs> I mean, go, ahead, eat, go ahead, eat the advance, and do something cool with your, uh, with your actual style, like get armor or um, make me discard a base or something. That one just spin, just spin the beat. Yeah, just yeah, basically. That is among the dumbest things I've said, and I've said a lot of dumb things. <laughs> all of her styles are switched. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, actually, supposed to be all of yeah. So once again, I think that I am going to play either burst or dodge here because I have min range. Yeah, and Gar has plenty of opportunity to go faster. Um, my fastest pair is going to be Switch Grasp for one, which gets blown out by any stun guard. So, yeah, I'm moving. What about, I mean, I would think, like, if you have if you have the spinner out, um, mm -hmm. let me check and look at what, like, your actual pairs and stuff are. Cannot be push-pulled, activate a weapon. Okay, so she has to be worried about this activate a weapon. Um, no, if she plays Blazing Sun, then Arsenal is super wasted. Well, I was actually thinking she could do something like uh, her, is it green, green eruption, right? If she doesn't want to move, right? Let's just, like, if she really didn't, because it's, that's not great, but she does have the option for something, I guess, if you kind of go a little fast, like path, maybe, clear sky path, and she can path pull also you. Moves. She yeah, but she can pull, in with spinner, I mean, she can pull you into her min range. I think one other cool thing here is that with the spinner, I think, because going in, I thought I chose Butter Knife first. I spent a lot of time planning to start with Butter Knife and contest Pryo. But I think the reason I chose the spinner was partly for free chip and partly because it gave me favorable uh, clashing on both Eruption and uh, Fire uh, at zero and minus two. Can you even clash Eruption? Uh um, yes. Uh, heavy, yeah, heavy burst right? minus one, right? Heavy, heavy, heavy burst does it. <laughs> yeah, heavy burst heavy also... Burst nothing else, okay. Yeah, but heavy burst also is pretty good against the green style if she doesn't want to move to, like, pull you into mid-range. So, what, what I'm thinking is heavy loses to everything, right? Because she just moves? Um, no. And, and she's faster and everything. Sure, okay. she, sure, she's faster, but um, she would have to advance two in order to get into mid-range, and... Um, if you burst, if it's you not mean. blazing sun, then no. I, I mean in the cluster. I mean in the cluster. So oh, it has um, so what you do? Oh, okay. I see yeah, what you're I, saying. I can dodge for. I can dodge for absolutely free. Uh, uh, that's not true. <laughs> I, a heavy, heavy do um, fire then um, clashes that. All right, yeah, I did not see you what you ended up taking. Yeah, I, I, I am completely unaware of what I'm. What this is. Alright, so what it's, do we got here? It's heavy, burst. <laughs> heavy burst versus what is that? Uh Grasp and Darkness Path. So, okay, so she did she th didn't want to uh, where are her stuff? This is a defense fight, I think. Uh yeah, I mean I, I guess. Oh. immunity is a questionable choice here 
because I'm going slowly. Yeah. I so. think it's just for the range, right? Um. Okay. Range is fine. It, it gives it. It gives it range to be first. Otherwise. Yeah, but I. I mean. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess not, right? If you're going first, she can. She'll move two, right? Uh. Which you'll still get hit. And she can't pull you. Yeah. Yeah, and heavy's pretty good against her. And I chip my way um into something approaching a decent beat here. Yeah. For sure, because she's going to move at start. Uh, she'll have to go first. Uh, it is an even twenty. Both take two. Ding. Yeah. Which then... is perfectly fine. And then she hits you for what is it? She can't pull you. So it's going to be two. Yep. Yeah. And you have armor one. Okay, so I mean this this worked out okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How much is it? The only problem is your range one with spinner. That's okay. That that makes the next um that makes the next move dodge. Like there's yeah. absolutely no way I don't have some way of an unclashable dodge here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then she gets back her freezing blizzard. Being cornered against guard doesn't seem that bad. Um, well, I mean, I guess you have the no, it's not. yellow style. She, she, can't, she can't freezing blizzard, so whatever. Yeah, freeze, freezing blizzard's ability to stop my dodge actually doesn't work here. Correct. So, you just always dodge out, which is, which is fun to make it. Uh, do you do a, uh, a weird Especially with her dodge? terrible prior spread, you can just uh, do a priority that she can flash and it's safe. And do you using like, path uh, on the last beat means that she doesn't have her, like, super options for movement. So, in Gar's position, I would use whichever style advances to. Driving Ren, I believe. I think there are a couple of them, aren't there? I mean, yeah, I mean, all, all of them move her. Well, no, just there's the one that gives her armor, and there's the one that uh, discards a base. I think it's Driving Range, right? Or Driving, driving Range is the one that moves the most. Yeah, because she, she, she wants to do it. As a before effect, Freezing Blizzard does it as a start effect, which is not as good. That's um, right. Now, when I'm looking at your options, uh -huh. you have, uh, like, are you going to try to get rid of the spinner this turn? Not, this, not this week, no. Okay, and that's just because you just want to hold on to it still for the chip. Yep, and, that's right. like, you'll surprise next turn or something? Yeah, that's probably what's going to happen. Um, again, my hope is that I can annoy the opponent into using Blazing Sun so that it's down and I can pull up a real weapon. Uh, uh, maybe you do Arsenal here. Um, uh, Arsenal Dodge? <laughs> no, just Arsenal Dodge. Um, that way you'll get rid of the weapon at the end of the turn, so she'll still take the chip this turn, and essentially they'll have a new weapon up. Uh, that would be a decent idea if I thought that I would lose the, uh, the next beat for having the spinner. And I am not entirely convinced that that is the calculation I made. Got it. I'm pretty sure you do lose the beat if you don't get rid of the spinner. Because then, um, um yeah, probably. Blazing Sun Hurl is free damage. Yeah, but I, I, I want Gar to use Blazing Sun. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think she you're also gonna... wants to play Blazing Sun. <laughs> okay, she likes so let her play, play, so let her play Blazing Sun. I pull out Chili Dispenser, and life goes on. Except yeah, because in... that's what I was thinking too. Like maybe you just have to get you like you want to bait her into something stupid or not stupid, but like just a Blazing Sun step. You know, like a take two damage, not a grip of damage, and okay. I do definitely yeah, think... Yeah, yeah the, the thing is that either you want to dodge the, the Blazing Suns mob, eat them. If you eat enough Blazing Suns, you lose. Sure. Yeah, but I mean, Blazing Suns step once is every two. three beats. Yeah. And okay. I, so this is Mobile Dodge, which is at two. It's, uh, a, face up. it's something that uh, Gar can't counter. Yep. She uh, has... Fashable. Gar has yeah, definite holes has in her prior spread. Man, I, Gar yes. is a very, combination. Very glaring holes. Yeah, Gar is a combination of things that I hate. Like, can't <laughs> clash, no tricks. It's just, 
She is my antithesis as a character. <laughs> Uh, and then, okay, so this is the green hurl. Is that what that is? Uh, yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, so uh, because of mobile, I can get another uh, space out, which is nice. Yep. So I can end this at uh, two range guaranteed. Yeah, so then she won't, she won't move. So she won't take any chip from Chili, but you'll end up being at range four, no, I, three? I, I think, four, I, I, I think that she should advance here. Well, she can't, right? If it's the green one, is that what that is? Green um, one doesn't have. It's is, just is push and pull. It's not hit. Oh, okay. Then yeah, that's no movement. Okay, then this is great for me. Yeah. So then yep. I would have gotten that, blown this out. This is why we don't arsenal. Of. Yep, hundred percent. This is why I would have gotten blown out. You see, this is where you dodge, is Gar. Uh, <laughs> no, oh man, and no dodge at, at, at four range. Dodging at yeah. four range, really? Uh, spinner. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd love. The mid -range, right? so. uh, I'm sure you would love to see guard dodge right now, since that's an automatic win for Chief. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. at this point, well, the cards that I would play as Gar happen to be locked. Um, this is the right time to play Grasping Darkness, either Eruption or uh, or Fire. Yeah, yeah so you can just play Eruption or something. Okay, you did mobile dodge, right? Well, um, yes, mobile dodge. Yeah, there we go. But the reason I say grasping darkness is because stun immunity is actually pretty good. Um, Gar's uh, guard is not very high. On mm -hmm. like it, it, it won't stop her from getting uh, stunned out by alpha strikes, basically. Yeah. Um. Okay. So here is and a. You do have an alpha strike. Here is no, a legit. Don't. I don't think you can stun eruption. Uh, you might not be able to stun eruption, but what what I was more wondering about is something like blazing sun eruption, which ordinarily is not very good, right? But if we want to stun you for sure and make you get rid of chili dis or uh, the spinner at this distance, which we kind of do, you know. Um. No, I can stun that. Is that breeze shooter? Does the breeze shooter do push How do you one? Stun it? Um, something like Arsenal Strike, um, and I play, uh, what's Skull it? Blaster? Yeah, it's not enough. Skull, Skull Blaster? That's, it's now not enough. Five, that's now five damage. Yeah, which is not enough. If it's you enough just... That's four guard. Okay. So yeah. Just empty some guard. Uh, yeah, so I, I calculated that as well. I think a better question is, can you just sit at this range uh, and bring out, like, Breeze Shooters? Like, if you don't get blown out this turn... If you breeze shooters here, this is exactly the Dolores question or the Del the Dolores situation that made me think Gar was bad. If you sit there and push her one every turn, like she has a very limited set of things that can touch you, like it is eruption, it's uh, whatever the her shot that is zero is, and like that's it, right? If you can just push her one, she can't ever dodge back in, you know. Um, no, she kind of can. There's the advance two and then lunge. So she can hit you at five range. Sure, but you can also. What I guess and, what and, I mean there is all of those things are face up prios that can't be duplicated. You know, like they're all yeah, after a few beats, they all become locked. Sure. Right. So you can just say, "I'm not going to get hit." I mean, you you will eventually get eat an eruption, right? Which you at negative two or whatever, but. When I played it against her as Dolores, it was I just clashed the one thing that was going to hit me for like two turns, eight an eruption, beat on her again, two turns the same way, eight an eruption again, but she never got back in because, and it's not like it was poor play. They just there's no other things that get in, you know. Um, eventually, I imagine that Gar would play Path. But sure. It's, yeah, I, I see. I see where you're going with this, and. Yeah, that's fine. I think I reserved pre-shooters because I wanted to have them for a beat where I could play Arsenal, Grasp, or Strike or something with pre-shooters and Toothpick, and then have a guaranteed finisher. And Ooh. mix going back to what happened in the quarterfinal against 9SK, that right there is exactly why I went for the pre-shooters and not Musashi. Because okay. I, I did I did my planning with Gar, so. <laughs> okay. I'm not. It, 
Takeshi is so hard for me to wrap my brain around. Uh, there's so he's, much here. He's basically a stat stick. He's an oppressor. Yeah, but I, I mean, I mean, when I'm, but I guess where where I'm going with this is when I'm staring at Arsenal surprise, you know, and then I have any one of these things that could become active. Yeah. Like, I can't calculate all those possible attacks in a week. Well, the, the nice thing is that it's pretty easy. You can simplify it to, if Takeshi plays Arsenal early on, you're going to get hit very hard. Unless you've done something to either stun or otherwise get in a blind spot. I mean, it really uh, is that simple. Out of the um, uh, so you have a, a minus one, plus one. A plus one, minus one. Arsenal, which is basically a plus one, minus one. Since it's minus one minus one, but you can put the power, um, and it, you know you can't you can't get the extra trial, but you can get it. Um, which is good. All right. And there's no. which is um, caustic. Hey, look at this. We're um, swift drive. Heating up eruption. Oh okay. Oh man. Just, just dodging it. <laughs> the what? Your your. Such a savant. This is... Why would you dodge in this? You can beat the eruption. You can easily beat the eruption. I mean, we, aren't we easily beating the eruption as is? Shift, grasp. Very easy. Uh, so it's going to move one. You, you would have missed anyway, but you would be a made six instead of... Instead of... Is this one. just a no beat, then? Um, is this a if, if Takeshi wants I, it? Is, uh, that's Freezing Blizzard, right? Yeah, so it depends yeah. if they... I mean, I assume they're going to retreat. Uh, they have to advance, right? otherwise... Oh, if they retreat, uh, Takeshi hits for free. Oh, well, Takeshi has to advance... Was it mobile? Uh, could stay still. Shift. Two to five. Oh, yeah. She has to advance. You are correct. Yeah. Yikes. Uh, yeah, uh, Swift Grass would be lethal. No. Which we think is also lethal, uh, so the game's over. Uh, I mean... Yep. Uh, yeah. The game's over, and the game's actually over. So yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking, like, oh no. Because there is no actual comeback from this position. Correct. Uh, yeah, that, that explains why the game is not long. <laughs> Spoilers! Spoilers. Uh, yeah, I'm, I, I want to, like, build up and, like, make hype that, hey, you can come back, but you're Gar, so it's not like we're dodging back in, so we're not coming back. And our eruption fan. Yeah, this, this, this would be where I would make up an achievement. Yeah. Uh, never trash a, a weapon as Takeshi and go for it, because this is... <laughs> Yeah. So bad for Gar. This is horrible. Uh, I actually do not think that Gar can win now. Uh, I mean, I I, I, I could be that. wrong. I could be I wrong, but we even have, have the have spinner still up. But I do have the spinner, which means that I hit more or less anything, especially if I play something mm -hmm. like Brasp, because that will out prio um, path. So you have, really, um, my option is, or my choice so is, do I care about um, getting hit? And specifically by getting hit by uh, fire with any kind of advance. I mean, the, I guess the only one that you would have to worry about, right, is Blazing Sunfire. Um, or, or maybe Blazing Lunge? Blazing Sun Lunge would hit you too right here. Uh, no, it wouldn't. No. Blazing, Blazing Sun is one to three. Yeah. And you have to drive in my lunch. So is this going to be a prio zero move for me? I'm asking that as a question because I don't know. Oh, yeah, so and this is the I guard think you need problem. To cover path. I think you need to be faster. Well no, I'm this is the guard problem, right? The guard problem no, is I, you're correct. They're gonna fire, but you don't it's not like you have any other options. If you choose fire as your which is your only thing, your prio is always zero. So if you beat them with, and you have a negative one, so literally just even a minus one shot. Do we have that? I guess. Ooh. Um. Yeah. Yes. yes. Arsenal. Ar Arsenal. Um, or we could just. But you, do... don't, you don't want to lose to to path. That's really. To well, path. How? Path hit me. 
The path isn't going to hit. Rain path. Driving rain path doesn't Driving hit. Driving rain path. Yes, it does. It's uh, uh, advanced it to advanced this one. And okay, it, yeah. It, it ducks. It ducks bursts, especially because you have spinner. So it's very tight, Advanced. I'm not one. sure what you can actually do against path and all the other options. I think you have to trade down with fire. Uh, is that uh, true? You don't trade that down because you have spinner, so you, the advance doesn't hurt. You can technically eat the path and just chip tree, but. Uh, yeah, so why isn't... I don't want to see how it works, actually. If, if, we care about, if we don't care about fire, then I would play something like Arsenal Strike. Arsenal yeah. Strike. Uh, what would your... Uh, that what the path the heart, the I mean... Okay. <laughs> Please, advance. A lot. Yeah, no, but like, I, I get it. But you're even training, and you're losing the amazing position. Uh, I can see like a burst and, and then I get that dodged. also loses the path. Yeah, but then we yes, could yes, also... You, you win this game automatically. Yeah, yeah okay. if you do like that Arsenal... That doesn't mean that you need to throw games. I don't know about Arsenal Strike. Maybe maybe even just something... First of all, Path has no stun guard. Right? That's uh, right. So we have we, we do have Grasping Darkness, which is not good enough, right? Is that true? Uh, it is true. Grasping... Mm -hmm. So advance one, yeah. So grasping darkness can't do it. So if we go faster than three, we can stun them out from a path, right? Yeah. Um. R remind me, is path a one-two range base? Yes. Yes. Okay, that's what I'm missing. Yeah. So it's one okay. two three three zero. Uh, starts uh, move one, hit push pull one to two after advance one to two. So, All right. So why not uh, heavy strike? Which is zero cryo. It gets ducked by uh, driving F. Okay. You win the B, but. Uh, you're, you're, gonna, you're not. You're never. You actually lose. You're only losing positioning at all. So. Because I was, if she gets positioning, she's dead. I was actually thinking if we. What's the life totals? Uh, 18 to 16? Uh, 18 we could do something like. Arsenal Drive, or maybe not Arsenal Drive. Uh, maybe like I can't drive. I can't just just grasp hit. No. Look. Yeah, I was thinking Arsenal grasp. Arsenal passes grasp. the path. Yeah, so Arsenal grasp. Um, and then yeah, or even just like Arsenal shot, Arsenal strike. Arsenal have we get toothpick? And we just send sure. them right back to the end of the <laughs> the end of the row. Okay, but like you don't need toast baby, you can just dodge. Yeah, like the positioning argument is not you, going you, to be something that sways to... me this beat. It's heavy burst. Okay. It's heavy burst. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I think it's fine. I mean, everything is fine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, take your <laughs> take your two it's for just, free. It's just you know. You know Obviously, it's right up. Yeah. yeah. Uh, um, but only by one. Sure, but only by one this turn. Right? We're I, still... And I'm already winning. <laughs> of course, yeah. We're still yeah. at point four. And now we still have that toothpick option if we want, or even just breeze shooters. Like, send them all the way back to the end. Yeah. Uh, in, in Gar's position... How would that... Uh, um, uh, this... Actually, this might be the Blazing Sun, uh, the Blazing Sun lunge beat. The Blazing like, Sun lunge beat. position. Yeah. Okay. Because I mean, you clash that easily. Yep. Um, Arsenal. Right? No, uh, I don't. I, I, I don't. Switch grasp. Switch grasp. <laughs> Switch grasp will do it. That is actually. I don't think. I don't think she can actually do anything about it. Uh. Yeah, I guess surprise dr surprise drive is not our other. <laughs> It's not great. Yeah, the thing the thing about surprise is that I <laughs> think you're so overrating tough. it. In the event that um, it, I would play surprise if I didn't like my current weapon, and I think right now I do. Yeah, With I that think... said, I have a, I have this strange sense that this is actually a surprise throw beat. Yeah, you can tell the different card back. Um, being played. Wait. What? Really? <laughs> yeah, that's a throw right there. 
Wait, what? Very well. Oh, here we go. I'm, I, I'm anti Dryo, so. Your Pryo. So this means I'm actually versus... contesting. Hey, it's surprise throw. Okay, so I surprise I... throw versus. Uh... Grasping Darkness Lunge. Grasping so, darkness. okay, that, that would also have hit. So you, I'm know, not you know what? I would have beaten back. Switch. Uh, last. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I was getting tired of the spinner anyway. So. Tired of it. I understand. Okay. Man, throw is such a weird pace. It's. Gar might be one of the few characters that I would feel somewhat comfortable with using it on because two to four range is. Yeah. And, and and to be clear, throw is actually a bit more versatile than that based on the style you pair it with. It doesn't always have to be surprise. Um, sw um, swift throw, if you can manage it, lets you keep whatever uh, power advantage you have. And there's the butter yep. knife. And you can okay. also... It, it's a lot more hit confirm. So surprise, what does surprise do? Okay, trash and Surprise trashes your weapon, yeah. Right, you get stunned. You mm -hmm. hit for five. Uh, doesn't yep. stun, and then you get to activate. You're you're only stunned once, right? Yes. So once you're stunned, that's it. You will this butter knife like they you can't get rid of your weapon twice. I I guess that would never happen because of how you get your weapon. But I believe that's correct. All right, and she advances, which is everything that I wanted. Yep. Because, uh, yeah. It's the lock sifts. Uh, and now it's seven just... to twelve. I feel yeah. It's a lot sob dodge, a switch dodge. I think is I, I still feel like there was something, some more we could have done to keep our position advantage and, and like with toothpick. Uh, you have position advantage. Um, to push them towards the end of the board. Uh, yeah, I, most I, likely. I it's, my my concern here is that. Blazing Sun hasn't come out yet. Correct. And there have been no I think Blazing that may suns. actually that may actually have been the reason that I played uh, Surprise Throw there. Okay, because, so you're just worried about that makes sense. Yeah. I, I figure I can try to contest Cryo. Um and if that was uh let me think about that. So Swift Throw is for Pryo, right? Yeah. What uh, did she just say? No, wait, wait, there's no way. That swift, swift throw is five, right? Or no, it's uh, three. Uh, four. Throw, My, bad. My bad. Four. You're, you're correct. So that should have been a clash. <laughs> we missed a clash. We all missed a clash. Surprise, fun card. Uh, yeah. Missed a clash. Yeah. yeah. And that's. No, maybe. Maybe you went oh, anti prio. No, 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 no. You went no, anti prio. Um, and, and didn't counter anti prio. That's what happened. Yeah. 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 Okay. Whoo! And. And. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it we actually. We even talked about that. <laughs> it's actually fairly bad if um, that does clash, because on the one hand, it's it stops the. Um, it stops the lunge, but I also lose my weapon, and there isn't a lot else I can do in that position. I guess I can dodge in. You, can you shot, almost don't. don't think she can do you also even it. have to do anything? Just don't take damage. That be it seems fine for you. Yeah, and I think I could do that with dodge. Well, the problem is, uh... no, yeah, and, you can't do it with dodge. Half beats stuff. Well, um, you know, like four or so. Well, if she's at four range, then I can, um, I can dodge into eruption, and nothing else should hit, given that, um. Path hits. Uh, fires in the garbage. Pathwood. All right, so uh, she can uh, strike the clash the thing that would clash path, and then a well, hush strike whatever. All right, so, so you have butterfly. This, what does this thing even do? Um, mm. it, it allows me to contest even Gar's fastest prios, but its range is very short, and I might lose it. Okay. If I stay too far away, which I'm not going to get too far away this beat. Also, though, so it seems good at what it does, but also, like, if you get rid of it, that seems fine. We're not so far, we're not, like, behind where um, 
we don't have viable weapons, so you have a lot of viable yeah. weapons still in here. But butter knife is it, it's good for what it does, but it's not actually that good. Uh, right. Takeshi would much rather be playing the heavy game here. The so what so, like a skull blaster? No, you can't. Uh, not necessarily skull blaster. More like chili dispenser. Uh, four of Takeshi's weapons are negative prio, and um, his better styles are also negative prio. So, on the other hand, on the positive side, you have butter knife, which is good prio but no range, and you lose it if you're too far away. And Takeshi appreciates being too far away. So, yeah, I would agree with that. This yeah, is... you don't get a uh, weapon if you lose it that way. So, I wonder That's if correct. is this Although just a... I didn't realize that at the time. I wonder if you're just dodging again here, because this yeah. this seems a, yeah, that... to be the, the I... blazing sun turn. Why am I anteing power? Why am I thinking about anteing power? It's you... arsenal grasp. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. So I'm Whoa. attempting. Okay, so I am contesting Pryo here. Um, this does lose to um, Step, which I'm okay with because that has teeny power. Right. This will clash Hurl, and everything else I can Arsenal up on. And so what? This so, is a Freezing Blizzard Smash versus, and uh, you have Butter Knife. You get to move. No, I don't get to move. I get to choose something that actually has range, which will be chili dispenser, breeze shooters, and lots of things here. Okay, yeah, got it. So I yeah. can choose whatever my heart desires here, and you it's going to be breeze shooters. Hey. Yeah, you also get your hit on butter knife, right? Uh, yes, which I'm is actually not very good for me here. Oh, you have to choose breeze shooters, otherwise you win. Gonna... All right, all right. So I. Push. Why am I moving forward? I uh, well, Butter you knife? switch spots. Oh yeah, because I hit. I get, I get it. I know. I know what my cards do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do I keep breeze shooters? I would say no, or I would say yes rather. I'm saying no to whatever I'm thinking of right now. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah I would definitely keep breeze shooters. That's I would the keep breeze shooters. Again. There we go. All right. So, three shooters not necessarily as good, but it means I have range for days. So, I wonder, can you? Uh, let me just see here. She just got back. What? Uh, so that was a smash. So she, okay, she did just get back. Fire. Fire. Yep. All right. So does she driving rain fire? Into I a would. Heavy burst. <laughs> So what I was actually wondering is, so driving rain fire, um, that thing bold. Uh, okay. Oh, come on. But I'm I'm wondering, can you dodge back? Like, can we establish yeah, that I, range? I think I think that is what I am going to try to do this beat with um, mobile uh, mobile dodge. I mean, we just go to max I, range and bust them out. <laughs> pretty much, and. Again, I was preparing to use my finisher here, but for a couple of reasons, I can't. So, um, nonetheless, I am doing the setup that I planned from the beginning. Just what does your finisher even do? Uh, finisher is almost full board starting at range 3, uh, 9 power, you are eliminated. And it's at um, 4 prio, plus breeze shooters gives you 5, which makes it very difficult to beat. Oh, you're... Your finishers get your weapons. That makes yes, them a lot that different. Is, that, that makes it a lot better. Yeah, that makes it significantly better. Uh, yeah. Hey, this thing's actually pretty good, then. Yeah, um, it is important to have either Musashi or Breeze Shooters when you do it, uh, partly to cover that um, max range issue, but, are, but also because... Um, five prio on your finisher is actually very good. It stops a lot of cheeky drives. Granted, guard doesn't have that, but even so. Uh, so here, the, and when I she uh, guard has a bunch of options, right? That hit at this spot. Um, I don't. It's unlikely uh, that it's clear sky. This is probably so. It's either blazing sun or driving rain, and the question is. This is something that covers burst. Has to be. 
So you kind of lose out on a lot of options. Yeah, you, you talk about this range, but I mean, you got it right to begin with. This is almost certainly dodging out of range with mobile dodge at two. Mm -hmm. Can't clash it, it goes faster than fire. I mean, if fire beats it. Yeah, that's just heavy. Heavy dodge does clash. Fire. I think I would heavy dodge. Heavy dodge is. Wait, we have. Uh, Breeze Shooters is minus one? It's plus one. Plus one. Hmm. Yeah. Um, heavy burst is what clashes a fire here. Um, yeah, that seems. The problem with that is it loses to. Yeah, your blazing sun steps and or blazing sun path rather and stuff like that. Specifically, only path. Uh, but yeah, path is always going to be. It looks super safe. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I wouldn't. Even, even I, though you pretty much. Have it. I. I want to like reestablish that max range, but maybe it's just I feel yeah, um, we might be covered. Yeah, um, mobile dodge will clash path here. Sure. Okay. Then, then you can do whatever you want because path is clashed. Yep. Yeah. Mobile dodge. You said that like you said that I ignored you. You said it. I ignored you, <laughs> and then you're like did it, and I'm like, oh yeah, exactly what I was Why looking for. Team power. Like, I am uh, I assuming that it's the bluff or... and that I'm not crazy. A very specific Why, why am I thinking of anteing for a cryo? Well, okay, it's, so you... Hey, it's mobile dodge. Mobile dodge versus... It's the flash turn, versus, so it's versus path. There we go. Alright. Is it just me? And, or is yeah, you, 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 can, you can see me grabbing a card right there, so this is something that I thought of. Yeah, uh, yeah strike is now lethal. Yes. Oh, I was going to say oh, the yeah. same thing. That, yeah. Can't clash strike, a reason. and we're dead. That would be exactly. a reason to anti-power on this. Yeah. Yeah. I like how current uh, you that was is insane. not... That would be much worse. Current you, you... Old you knew exactly what you were doing. <laughs> <laughs> I do this. I do this actually a fair amount of time. Uh, usually it's... Sometimes it's power... Uh, usually it's like stun guard. We're all anti stun guard on a dodge uh, for the class chain. I actually, I think I actually like do it too much because sometimes my dodge just goes off and I feel like, oh, well, I wasted two. Sometimes yeah, it matters. Sometimes it doesn't. Well, here, um, yeah, here it's great. This is especially against yeah, guard, but, right? But I mean, here if I lost it, okay. And yeah, this is me throwing the coin because. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm not driving anymore. Yeah. In fact, uh, you discard, push, pull, whatever, doesn't matter, and then you crash back for 1,200. Or, you know, lethal. It's exactly six. Yeah. Exactly, though. And, and the thing that would clash it is currently clashed. So, mm -hmm. the thing, and we, we already pointed out this, uh, this retreat back. Um, which was the first thing I was thinking was maybe they have to retreat and you can't. Okay, got it. That retreat back obviously costs in this game is the easy um, takeaway, you know. But I, I think that even had they advanced forward, you're still super favored. Um, but they never played Blazing Sun, so... Yeah, yeah, I, yeah the Blazing right. Sun was always covered. I think I, I think literally. Um. Well, no, uh, not blazing sun step, but the others are covered. Yeah, but if blazing I, sun is covered, then everything's covered. Cause all her stuff, right? <laughs> like that's gar, right? If you're covering, like you're covering a style, is a not real thing because all of her styles are zero. Well, that's not necessarily true. Um, for instance, on beat one when I did the heavy burst, that was. At worst case, damage mitigation against uh, Blazing Sun Lunge. That's the that's the pair that I've been looking at the entire game because it's Prio Four. Takeshi can't really hit Prio Four very easily, and it means stop, drop your weapons. Yep. Yeah, but you, still, you still have armor. You get chip one. Yeah, I just I don't I don't love guard very much at all. I don't I don't I remain. 
very unimpressed. And I lost a Gar. Right. I, I still I still don't like like her. I don't think that she's like she's an oppressor archetype. So the characters that she does well against, she's going to do very well against and the characters that hack her, she just kinda loses. Yeah. Or she or at the very least she has to play creatively. Uh, not only creatively, but you know, if you if you make a, a big positioning mistake, maybe not a big one, right? That'll that'll cost you the game. Um, but if you make a minor ish positioning mistake, you can fix it later with a dodge with any other character, and you can't with Gar. So yeah, like uh, one dodge by grasping darkness path closes five. Sure. That's, that's the part about being creative. The problem is that you just get you, you can't be creative with with like the styles and the bases. There's yeah. one thing in Battlecon that you cannot do, which is manipulate priorities. This is really big. This this takes away basically. You cannot clash. You can only be clashed. Correct. Yes. Right. Uh, because you don't have priorities. You don't have anything. Yeah, and that that it, was how, how just that, and bases but you can't you can't really right. avoid clashes no. either at all, yeah. right? And at all, at all. And it's not like um, one or like when, when you're sitting thinking about a pair, it's real easy to see how every clash in is going to go because you already know, right? Yes, you don't, and that is, I guess, part, supposed to be part of Gar's weakness. But it's like that along with no dodge. I just. I, uh, I really don't like it. Yeah, and then there's the no dodge part, which is like, why? It's just a nerf, right? It's just not necessary. Well, uh, it, it's, the, it's thematic. I think that the option, yeah, it is I, I think that the decision to not put any prio mods on her styles is probably the larger nerf. Because I get the idea that it's supposed to be zeros all the way around, but there are also a couple of styles that cheat that. Why not cheat with Ryo once? Yeah, I would love to see that. is a very special stat to mess with. Uh, I would love to have seen um, something kind of irrelevant, like Clear Sky have a minus one Pryo. Um, yeah, a minus one Pryo somewhere on a star. Because I don't think she's busted. Probably. That'll probably be a bit nerf. You think so? I actually do, I, I totally to disagree. For Gar, because we're talking about, like, uh, you're able to stop 100% her the, stuff. The, the, the cleaving Sky is, is probably style, especially if you make it slower. Um, yeah, I mean, maybe... Be faster, so. a clear, clear Sky already kind of sucks. It's mm -hmm. a, by far the, one of... No, it's easily her worst style. Um, probably, because she doesn't need power. Which one is Clear Sky? Uh, it's the one that doesn't uh, move and pushes move. her pulse. Uh, oh, it pushes pulse? Okay. Yeah, so... And, it, it, it's okay. It, yeah, it it's hit. fine. Yeah, is it better than her others? No. So if this had minus one, suddenly you couldn't just say, I can, I can stop every fire at prio zero. Now they can possibly be cheeky and use the bad style to get under. Mm -hmm. So now it's not a guaranteed clash. And maybe that actually not, might not be But then that would be it, like... It's not it's even a bad style, style because now you're pulling them back in. Yeah. So yeah, I think that it opens up a lot of options. That or, it, yeah. it doesn't have to confirm, and if you make it slower, that it stops the armor as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think we just make Gar. I guess it would make Gar a better character, yeah. But I, I don't know. It would not be fun to play with that style. I would give it to Freezing Blizzard. I don't think Gar's actually, fun to play right now. Because <laughs> the thing about the thing about um, Gar going faster is that she already has eight prio bases. So, okay. Yeah, but you want to pair it with like lunch. Okay. Uh, yeah, but I you just want to have that, you just want to present the mix up of the of one base not at the prio printed on, right? And it doesn't. Yeah. The style could be blank. Actual no. Yeah, the style could actually be blank. It, it should it's, give it. It should have switch. I, I don't know how. Just make switch have minus one time and everything is off. Uh, no thank you. As a person who loves Switch, no thank you. Uh, just for Gar. Just for Gar. Just for Gar, okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I, Maggie's Switch should have plus one prior. No, we'll see. 
Dark and class spiritual sassies. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't want that. Never mind. Oh, I do. So. Alright, yeah, let's, uh, let's end this here. And, uh, yeah, let's end this here. Uh, thanks, everyone. And, uh, we'll probably see you again soon. Okay.